Hello everybody, welcome to the video, I'm Viceroy and today we're going to be playing some Retail Company Simulator by publisher and developer Business Tycoon. So, Retail Company Simulator probably is uh, exactly how it sounds but you get to run your own retail company. Uh, description says you sign contracts with leading brands, order new products, meet customer needs and never let your customers leave the store empty handed. Hire new workers expand your store and enjoy the growth of your retail company. So let's get stuck in, shall we? Like this music. New game, name, Vice Roy, because why not? Well, uh, loading uh, was pretty quick, right? So this is a short tutorial for you to understand the game mechanics. Then you'll be fully ready to grow your humble store into a huge retail company. Please follow the tutorial steps shown in the right bottom corner of the screen. Okay. Store name. Name your store. Uh, you can click the store sign and change your store name anytime. Okay, let's have a look. Let's go with this because it looks quite cool and our retail company is going to be called Vi... Vice Corp. Oops, Vice Corp. Or Vice Corp? Vice Corp. There we go, Vice Corp. First order, interact with the computer. Click to access the computer and then right click to exit the computer. Uh, sign a contract with a brand. Go to the contract section and sign a contract with a brand. So we got Hillary Various and their products are pink crop t-shirt and yellow crop t-shirt. Okay. Sign new contract. Complete. Make an order. Go to the market section and add products to your cart. Bam, bam, bam. Add. How much money do we have? Let's buy them as well. Why not? $46. Buy. Delivery free. Right click to exit the computer. Pick up a box. Pick up the box. Pick up the box. Where is the box? Oh, it's in the, the back room. Ah, okay. Delivery area. Nice. Nice. Pick. Unpack the box and place products into a clothing rack. So. Ah, okay. We got it. We're getting it. Put the empty box in the trash. The lack of the game promotes for in there. Uh, Rubbish away. Now where's the trash can? <laughs> oh, it's at the back. Okay. Oop. And then pick up box. And rack number two. Okay. Set a price for the product. Click the label to set a price. You'd better consider the recommended retail price to set a fair price for your product. Okay. So there's the 278. Recommended retail price thirty ninety. So let's go for fourteen dollars. Approve, and then fifteen dollars for this one. Buy a fitting room. I like how the the signs look quite cool. Looks it tells you the manufacturer. You know how many are in stock on the rack. Okay, I, I like this. I like this. Buy a fitting room. Go to the market section and buy a fitting room. Equipment. Uh, fitting room. Okay, so you can buy hat racks, two-tier shoe racks. A couple of choices. Um, add to cart, check out, $500. Place a fitting room. How does one place a fitting room? The customers can try on clothes in fitting rooms before deciding whether to purchase them. So how does one... You just... Ah, okay. So they don't snap. So you can basically place them wherever you want them. So let's put them as close to the corner here as we can. There we are. Okay. Open the store. You can open or close the store by clicking the open slash close sign at the entrance. Ta-da! Interact with the cash register and wait for the first customer. Scan the products by clicking on each, take the money from the customer, give the change to the customer and complete the checkout process. I'm glad we got a card reader. So spacebar is to complete the checkout, right is to get change back and then right click again to exit. Got it.
And even though this game is only released today, the 6th of August, the publisher um, and developer even have already put out a small patch to fix some issues. So that's good. Um, yeah. Click the rack, take the money, change $86. Um, so we got 50, 60, 70, 80, 5, 6. Space bar. Okay, we'll get the hang of this. Um, ooh, card. Okay. Card. $14. Approved. And card again. Oh, I wonder if you can type it like on you. Ah, you can. Awesome. And we got to complete eight checkouts. Hopefully, mostly people will pay by card. Because it's easier. It's a lazy option, right? <laughs> Who wouldn't? That's a very nice t shirt for you, sir. $14. What's the thought? I wonder if we can change the currency. Probably not, but uh, gameplay. Ah, uh, that would be nice if you can choose the currency symbol. Maybe in a future update. The card payment. I like though most people are paying by card instead of cash. That's good. So we got to complete four more checkouts. There's nobody in the store at the moment, so let's... Uh, so there's two left, two of those left in stock. We haven't sold a single yellow t-shirt yet. Is it worth buying more stock yet, do you think? Hmm. What tells you your stock in store as well on this bit? That's handy. That's really handy. Oh yeah, that's all we can sell so far. Um, so let's buy some more pink t-shirts. In anticipation of some more sales, we can restock the shelf. I wonder if there's like a storeroom section you can get. Now that the rack is full, um, close the box and we put it like, is this a storeroom? If it isn't a storeroom, it is now. <laughs> there's another door there. I wonder what's in there. Oop, customer. Ash. Uh, $85 change. 50, 60, 70, 85. Ooh, two t shirts. We finally sold a yellow t shirt. $29, please. Thank you. Just type 29. Yeah, that works too. Awesome. Up in the corner, I can see the time has just gone 3 p.m. in the afternoon, and we are, I'm guessing, a level one store, but soon to be level two. At least that's how it looks. Another two t-shirts, $29. Nice. Yay, store leveled up. Signed a new contract. Why not? Contracts. Um, B and D. Basic turquoise t-shirt, sunset graphic t-shirt. Okay. Tutorial completed. Make some more sales, and then we'll buy some more stock. Thirty dollars. Thank you very much. Much uh, new racks. So look, equipment, clothing racks, a hundred dollars. Double rod clothing rack, or three-way clothing rack. Um, what do we have at the moment then? Just a standard, uh, standard rack. Twenty-eight dollars, please. Ooh, exact change. Thank you. $29. The simulator games are really popular at the moment, aren't they? But they are fun to play. Um, 20, 35, 6. Let's buy a clothing rack and some more of the new product. Just buy that one. Put this out first. I like how we got the grids though, so you can try and line things up. Would you prefer snapping though? Like snapping to grid, or do you think it's better to have the free form to place things as you please, like like that? Okay, so that goes in the bin, storeroom, because we still have some of these pink t-shirts left. Oops. I walk through a door apparently. Need more stock. So we need more. Let's try buying um, some of these and some more of these. Oh, we'll be with you in a second. Just a second. 
Customer couldn't find yellow crop t-shirt. Ah, uh, no. Um, I just set a price before we set them a cost. Uh, $23 these ones can be. And these ones can be $13. It's quite an expensive uh, top, isn't it? Sun it looks cool, though. Sunset graphic. Close and put down. Okay. Change, $21. $21. Maybe we should buy another clothing rack. We have the money. We can do it. Um, equipment, clothing rack. Oh, and we should probably should have bought the uh, thing to go on it too. There we go. Put that like this, close as we can. Good stuff. And will it remember the price we set before? Ah, it did. Awesome. Oop, it's a bit of a queue. Sorry for the wait. $46, please. $13, exact change. 27. Okay, so end day. So it's now 10 p.m. I mean, it's quite bright for uh, 10 p.m., but... There's some pink tops left. How many are on the racks? Seven, six, eight, six. Seven, eight, six, eight. Yep. Yeah. Well, is it worth ordering some more stock in, ready to go? Let's end the day. So daily report, day one for Vicorp. Income, $402. Quite a bit of expenses. So balance of minus 1,139, 68. But we've gained 86 points from all our sales and things. We've lost some points because of no available product. But everybody thinks the prices are fair. Day number two. Welcome back to Vicorp. Ooh, let's go for that. It's got a dragon in it. And because I'm from Wales, the dragon's cool. Um, what we got? Three. Equipment. Spiral clothing rack. Other RAM contracts could we get, maybe? Oh, these are all require level 3, okay. $250, $300 value, $300. That means it costs $300 to sign with them, yeah? Um, So, we have enough clothing racks for each type of item at the moment then, so we're going to stick with that. Oh, we need to open the shop. It doesn't look like the timer starts until... um. Or the, the, yeah, the time of day starts until you open the store anyway, so it's fine. Maybe we should order some more stock in, though, in anticipation of a good sales day. So we'll order one of everything. Oops. Because we can afford to. Oh, it's an A again. <laughs> Rush in, those. Okay. So we got stock. I wonder if we can get some uh, shelves for the stock room, though. That'd be nice. Stick the boxes on. I'm assuming this is the stock room. I might be completely wrong. Might be something else. Equipment wise, what can we order then? If we go to equipment, um, warehouse. Ah, warehouse rack, okay. Let's get double one because we can afford it. Oops, serve the customer first. Um, card payment, $15. Thank you. A warehouse rack. Dun, 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 dun. I'm guessing when we eventually are able to hire staff, they will automatically sort of put things on these shelves and stock the shelves in the store from these two. Who can you use the top? You can use the top. Ah, okay. That stores quite a bit, to be fair. That's good. We have $21 now, so we need to make some sales. What's on this back road? <laughs> two uh, dead end signs. <laughs> You can pick up the box from the trash. Oh, it even tells you on the storage shelf what's uh, what's on the rack. Can you double things up? No. Doesn't make sense. Who does it? You fair? Ooh, customer. Hello there. Twenty-nine dollars, please. Ah, uh, hard payments. Love it. I mean, that is true, though, isn't it? Like a lot of people would. I dare say like 80%, maybe 70 to 80% of people would elect to pay on card these days, I reckon. 
Uh, so we need some more of these. Going into walls. I'm very good at this navigating thing, am I? Oh, it says warehouse there. Uh. <laughs> Seventy-one dollars change. Fifty, sixty, seventy-one. Thank you for your custom. Please come again. I guess some more of these on the shelf because we don't want to run out of stock, do we? I'm gonna sell as much as we can. I think we need some more pink ones on the shelf. Um, turquoise ones as well could do with a bit of a restock. Let's serve the customers first. Thirty-seven dollars. Some decent sales there. Eighty-seven dollars change. Fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty-seven. Thank you. Twenty-two dollars change. Twenty-two. And we need some more turquoise tops. Turquoise is a top shelf. Nyom. Like this background music. I hope, hopefully, it's not the MCA protected because it's quite nice, and I'll move the video if it is. So if I have to re-upload the video, you know why. <laughs> uh, ten, sixty. Oops. Oh no. Um. Ah, there we go. Fifty, sixty, two. What if they um complain if it takes too long to give them the change? Are we looking on stock? We'll bring some more yellow tops out. Oh, that box is empty now. Probably should order more yellow tops at some point. $35 change. $20.35. Thank you. $38. I wonder if it's like an upgrades path. Expansion. Ooh. So we got expansion for warehouse and store. But a few expansions by the looks of it. Inventory. Oh, that's handy. Tell us what... Oh, cool. Okay. So if we... Add to cart. Ah, oh, that's awesome. So you can just stock up the inventory you already have. In your store, in your stock. So I'm guessing in your stock's in the warehouse. In your store then is what's actually out on the... Oh, that's really handy. I like that. Workers. Oh, we can't um, hire our first worker until level 7. Bank. Wallpapers. <laughs> nice. Let's go with a nice... Oh, hang on. We've probably got customers waiting. It's us playing with wallpapers and we have customers to serve. 73. 50, 60, 73. Yay, level 3 store. Thank you, everybody. I couldn't have done it without you. 71, 50, 60, 71. An exact change. Nice one. Let's order some more. Oh, hang on. We might not need to. Pink ones we still have in stock. Ooh, almost finished the box. Almost. Um, so what if you... Can you combine boxes then? No. Get some more of these out on the shelves. The box is now empty. We could probably sign a new brand deal now, couldn't we? Twenty-six dollars. Twenty-eight dollars. Don't forget, if you're using the uh, card machine, you can use your numpad on your keyboard. Very good feature. He thinks. Okay. It's now almost 10 p.m. Store is closed. Oh, so it closes automatically. I'm sure people came in after the store closed before. We can sign a new contract for these or these now. White t shirt, bird printed t shirt. Oh, let's go with. Okay, let's go with this one. Probably going to need a new rack to store them on. We only have $232. We're going to have to buy one of these. 16 capacity, 9 capacity. Clothes, 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 clothes. Shoes. Hats, hats. 
We're going to buy another cash register. Wall rack. Ooh. Wall rack. I'll have to have a look at that one when we got the money to. So it holds eight the same as this one, but probably a bit more space. Or 16 on this one for 550. Right. Um, we can't afford any new... Oh, we can afford new products. on my own, but... So what do we need to restock? Um, oh, we, we, we got the answer to this. And we inventory. So in stock. In stock, in store. In your stock. Six, seven, zero, zero. Oh, yeah, we haven't ordered those yet. Eight and two. Okay. So in your stock, in your store. Seven, seven, in store. Seven in store, zero in stock. Okay, so we're going to buy some more of those. We're going to buy some more of those. And got, we've got three in stock there. We're going to buy some more of these. And we may as well buy some more of those as well while we're at it. Day ended. Ah, oh, you can't order. Okay, so we'll end the day then and order in the morning before we open the store. So 95 points. Customers could, could find everything this time. So that's good. We served 23 customers. And balance is minus 247.36. Good morning. Market prices of the following products have changed. Razorback time top. Okay, so we're not stocking them at the moment. Let's get this order in. I'm glad I remembered what I added. Um, that's full, so we stick these on the shelf. These, I think we need more of. Oh, we have some in stock of those as well. Yellow t-shirts. We're looking on yellow t-shirts. Well, they could do with a bit of a top up. Not much though. And pink t-shirts. They're full. We got a lot, a lot of pink t-shirts. Okay, people might complain today about not being able to find the new products that we've uh, recently, the beige sweatshirt and the white Razorback tank top. 3664, 3664, 2290, okay, none of these prices have changed, so we're good. It's selling just above the recommended retail price and people are not complaining, so it's good. Ah, I knew people were going to complain about not being able to find the, uh, the sweatshirt. Sorry, please come back, we'll have them tomorrow, maybe even later. What's in there? Oh, look at the butterflies. That looks cool. The graphics on this game are pretty decent, aren't they? He just walked out of nowhere. Ooh, customer. You can think of a better name for the store, by the way. Let me know in the comments, and if, it, if I like it, I may even change the store name to it. Sensible suggestions, though, bees. <laughs> okay, we got an incoming customer. Get ready at the tills. Thank you. $24 change. Oops. Is that change? Nice one. Okay, so we couldn't find beige sweatshirt. I know, I know. We'll have them soon, I promise. We need to get a uh, clothing rack first, though. Yeah, it's going to have to be this one for now. On well, big purchases, people. We have money to be made. Stock to buy. So $77.60. Again, there. What's the next, what's the type of contracts we can go for? Ooh, wow. Look at the price on that. That's a nice looking suit. <laughs> this was lots of options. Like it. Next. It's a nice cash register, isn't it? $13. She's walking through the clothing racks. Thank you. 
twenty dollars change. Right now we can afford a new clothing rack. Should I look how much the sweatshirts were? Shouldn't I? I might be able to buy something to uh, stock on it too. Most people are after the sweatshirts at the moment, so I think we'll buy that first. We need to afford it. 37. We can. Let's get some of those on the shelves ASAP. If I get more complaints, we don't have any. Okay, we'll drop the box at the moment. So we can set the price. Um, 37.99 is Garby 38.50. I think that's fair. I wonder if it will allow us to sell things if we forget to set the price and we'll just end up like selling it all for cost. Which wouldn't be good, but oh, turn on. $29, thank you. Started to type the card payment uh, option in there. 2035. Oop, yellow t shirts that we're running low on. We have some? Yes, we do. Now, as soon as I get those other things in stock, people complain that the other things out of stock then. Typical. What else are we looking? Turquoise t-shirts are need in stock, but we'll do that in a sec. Thank you. $62 change. $35 change. There we go. Oh, what did I say? Um, turquoise. Nyom. Turquoise. There we go. We will bring some more pink ones out too. Finished off that box nicely. Got more of the pink ones than anything, so oh, that box is now empty as well. Okay, how are we looking on everything else? Could do with some more sweatshirts, maybe. Oh, they all want those tops. Now they mentioned it. Nobody wanted them, then everybody wanted them. The way it goes. We'll get them soon. Say that. I wonder if you can put... Oh, you can't. One, one item per clothing rack, isn't it? Because you set the price for the whole rack. Uh, $61.50. That's a nice sale. $28. Still, all sales are appreciated. $28. I think I more than one box at a time. Nope. That's still full. Take her back on the shelf a sec then. Um, pink and yellow. Need more pink and yellow. the yellow in a sec once we've uh, served her. 38. Thank you. Oh, now them. Oh, we've run out of yellow. Oh, hello. $14. Now we can... Oh, it's the end of the day. Getting the cart ready. Uh, so we have 238. So we can buy one of those and... And buy some of these finally. Okay, end day. So we've <laughs> we've gained five dollars sixteen cents more than yesterday, and quite a few customers who couldn't find what they were looking for. So we got penalized for that. Okay, let's get this order in. Market prices have changed for the following. So, wait. Ah. does it tell you on you? They've missed the second one. No, no, it doesn't. That's all we can afford anyway. Okay, now we got these in stock finally. People can stop complaining about it. <laughs> oh, one box didn't fill the whole rack. I don't think. There was only six in the box, okay. So 10.55, that's easily $11. 
Um, 22, 23.90, 15.40, 90, 14.30, 90, $13 recommended retail price. So he's gone down in price. So if we set them to 11, then 38.50, yeah, that's the same. Open the shop. Oh, probably should have finished stocking the shelves first, shouldn't we? Um, we don't have any more yellow t shirts, but we can bring some more turquoise ones out. Might finish off the box, yep. Make some sales and then we'll stock up on the stock. And stock up on the stock. Come on, customers. Sail on. Not really, but as you through the door. There we go. Any other options? Any secret? Oh, they that's handy, it stays on the computer. So turquoise t-shirt's gone down. Racerback tank top has, I'm guessing, stayed the same. Is that what that means? Oh, first customer in, two tank tops. Our clothing store empire is coming along nicely. Come one, come all. Twenty five. All these card payments, love it. Sixty seven dollars. We now can now afford to buy some. Get some more tank tops in and yellow tops. Tank and yellow. Tank and yellow. Tank and yellow. Yeah, we could have done this through the inventory screen. A customer thinks basic t uh, turquoise t-shirt has an unfair price. Okay. Um, how about ten fifty then? Is that better? Fifty-three fifty. Now back to cash. Eighty-six dollars change. Won't be long before we have chains all over the world. There's some more of these on the shelf because these have sold quite well. Empty the box. And yellow t-shirts. Okay, so it's, uh, we should really use the inventory screen. It's easier, isn't it? So it shows in your store, in your store down this side, and then in stock. And then when you click that, it just flips the numbers around. Turquoise t-shirt has an unfair price. All right then, how about ten twenty? Not gonna go back and buy it after complaining about the price? No? Okay. That's my thing, Spate. Well, the prices were fine before. <laughs> um, 38 then. A penny more than the retail, or a cent more than the re recommended retail price. Is that better for you prices wise everybody? Oh, that's our box empty. Nice oops. Wrong way. There we go. We need some more of these uh gra sunset graphic t-shirts. $47. Chain. 40, 5, 6, 7. $78 change. Too far. 75, 6, 7, 8, 50, 78. 74, 80 change. <laughs> oh, 
Got a few sales though, I'm not gonna complain about that. Yay, card payment. Okay, sunset t-shirts market. And I get these on the shelf. We had some in storage as well. Oops. Oh, box actually. Turquoise and a beige sweatshirt. Uh, like it says on the box as well, the name of the item. Graphics are good on this. It's very well thought out, I think. Beige sweatshirt. Let's get some more of those. First, let's serve these guys. 25, 20. Oh, no. No change. Exact change. Thank you. $23. Twenty-five. Nope. Exact change. Awesome. Meow. We're looking for a stock and everything else. Pretty decent. We could do with some yellow uh, t-shirts out there. Nope. That was the last one. Fourteen dollars. Oh, four hundred and fifty-three dollars. Now we're up to. Forty-eight twenty. Oh, hang on. I'm giving them change, and they paid exact change. <laughs> that was a bad. I should pay attention, shouldn't I? Thank you. I was just giving money away there. That was that was poor, wasn't it? That wasn't a good choice. Right, contracts. We have. We could sign this one. A white T-shirt. It's three hundred and fifty dollars, though. Or do we spend money getting some more shelving? I want to see what this one's like. $100, $580. We can't afford the price. Let's try this one. I want to see what it's like. Oh, day's ended. Okay. End day. Oh, 107 uh, points. Nice. And to the end of the day, uh, $292.41 more than we had yesterday. So, prices have changed, to make sure we look at that before we open up. So, basic turquoise turquoise t-shirt has gone up in price. So, oh, we've run out of those anyway. It's like people knew. Do we have any in stock? Um, no. So, we should order more of those. So, turquoise t-shirts. Uh, oh. Sunset Graphic T-shirt has gone down in price, so it's twenty dollars. We're going to charge twenty dollars and fifty cents, or twenty-five cents, because people will complain probably. And um, basic, so we got this and this. What does what does it mean? What does it mean? We do need to order more in. Um, Catching. You don't have enough money. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. We're going to have to forfeit that for a minute then, aren't we? Unless having shelves if we don't have any stock on it. Um, yeah, I think we're good to open for the day. Come on in, folks. some more of those and those because we don't have any in stock and these because we don't have any in stock and this because we don't have any in stock it's always best to have things in stock right just in case let's go come on in folks this way come on this way Hmm. 
else can we buy? Equipment. Equipment. I'll just a uh, fitting room and cash register at the moment. Ooh, our first customer of the day. Been open since 9 and the first customers walk in at quarter past 11. Let's do this thing. $85 change. Thank you. No change. We're not going to throw money at people today. $24 change. Come on, walk this way. Walk this way. $86 change. A lot of change. $410 we're up to now. We have some stock. So let's get one of these. Let's see what they like. Wall rack. Oh, these do clip to the wall. Ah, handy. That is handy. Let's put that there. Right. Good to know that they clip to the wall. We got wise uh, wall racks. That was 400, 580 for the double one, which holds 16. So that's a good price, I feel, considering like, you know, $400 for a single one. Yet, not really anywhere near double the price for the double wall rack. And then this one holds 39 clothes and shoes. Well, like 39 items in total, but shoes and uh, clothes. And this is 16, so 550 to hold 16, but four line wall rack. So does that mean you can have like, 4, 8, 12, 16. Oh, oops, sorry. <laughs> it's a hell of a queue. I'm just sort of looking at things and uh, yeah. Pay attention. <laughs> Pay attention. Right, 59, 50, 55, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. Thank you. Sorry for the wait. I was doing business stuffs. Couldn't find yellow crop t shirt. Have we run out? Uh, no change. No change. We have run out. Nope, wrong one. Um, up there. Here we are, we're back in stock now. Come back. Come back. Yay, level four store. Level four store. It's a level four store. So now we need some stock to go on there, don't we? And what better than something we don't have? <laughs> oh, we need to restock these. Like how the box closes automatically as well when you uh, put it back on the shelf as handy. Quality of life improvement. Okay, what are we missing? Ooh, beige tops. We're almost out of beige tops. Red alert. Meow. There we go. Oh, we only have one in there. We need to buy more of those. Do we not have more of those? Damn, we don't. Beige tops. We bought the last ones. <laughs> but not going to argue with that nice sale. Three items. Thank you very much. So, Because we're level four store now, people just like buying more things. Oh. You are new, I think. 50, 60, 70, 80. Ah, uh, yeah, sorry, this guy brought the last tank top. We're doing very good at these stock levels, are we? We have more tank tops. Sure we do. Yeah, we do. Get these out before we serve anybody else. There we go. Eighteen seventy-five. Fifty, sixty, seventy-five. No change, thank you. Oh, it's eight PM. Um we need to get more beige tops out here. Not in that one. There we go. Rack is full, I think. Da da ba da 
Ta-da, ta-da, ta-da. Ooh, um, contracts. Ooh. Yeah, let's go with that one. We have, do we have enough to buy any stock? 139.98, we do not. We do for this one, though. Buy the new stock stuff. And you get to go on the new rack. Well, okay, it looks good. Um, 22.90, so it's easily 23. <laughs> Store closed. Oh, no. Oh, we've got a couple of customers to serve before the end of the day. We're good. We're good. $70 change. Like, all these people run, walking around with, like, $100 bills. Twenty six seventy five. Coins don't sound real, do they? <laughs> 22. Okay. Thank you, everybody, for your customer. Much appreciated. Um, are we looking on stock? Uh, well, it's too late to order anything, but we need more yellow tops. Do we have some of those? Uh, no. And we need more... Tank tops and turquoise tops. We do have more turquoise tops. Okay. Merangle. I do like that uh, war rack. It looks quite cool. Hey, folks. I'm going to leave the video there. Thank you very much for watching. If you did indeed like the video, please feel free to hit that thumbs up button. And if you're not already, a subscribe to the channel will be amazing. And leave a comment down below if you are thinking about getting Retail Company Simulator or going to wishlist it potentially for the near future. And uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Bye for now, everybody. Thanks for watching.